Hello everyone and welcome back to Sapphire Cut TV with me your host Ammo HD. We are going to be continuing onwards now, uh, so let's get on with it. That cormorant fisherman is a grandmaster? Huh, I guess you really can't judge a book by its cover. So, did you find out what style that monster uses? He didn't tell me. Does that fisherman even know? I'm not sure. I sparred with the grandmaster, and he said my kung fu was lacking. But it'd do me no good to know. You idiot. You can still win even if you don't have enough kung fu. Really? Hold on. Hey, is there anywhere you can learn kung fu? At some school or dojo, I suppose. Oh, there might be a martial arts expert there. Well, go look for a place that teaches kung fu. Good idea. That simple, is it? Okay, so the school is over here. We haven't been here for a while. I haven't really felt that much of a need to, to be honest. I mean, it's very similar to Marshall Hall and in, in Bailu Village. I love how they just appear out of nowhere. Excuse me. Are you here to train? Actually. I have a question. Oh, and what might that be? It's about Kung Fu. Ah, then you've come to the right person. I had a run-in with a martial artist that uses an unorthodox style. Unorthodox? Yeah, there were animal movements mixed in. Animal movements? Hmm. Yeah, I was wondering if you could identify it. This martial artist, do you know who he is or where he's from? Oh, um, he's the Red Snake's big guy. Red Snake's? I heard that a young man's been waging war on them. That's not you, is it? I don't know about war, but yeah. How reckless. One man alone cannot stand up to an entire gang. That is true. I know. But... It's best not to get involved. I see. So, okay, what then? Hi there. I cannot condone, much less be a part of your reckless crusade. There's no sense in throwing your life away. I see. Well, so he's not gonna teach us then? So what am I supposed to do now then? Oh. Um. Oh. Come on, move! So what are we supposed to do now then? Doesn't want to teach us. Um. What other masters are there? So there's him. There's the fisherman. Who said he doesn't want to teach us? There's. Should we try again, the Mr. Shu or whatever his name is? Uh, he might be able to teach us. He's the only other teacher I know around here. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I can't really think of anybody else that we can go and talk to unless there's somebody. That we don't, but at the moment I don't think that that is the case. I think that's pretty much those three people. Um, so there's Mr. Shu, then there's his master, Grandmaster Bay, the fisherman, 
who says that we're not good enough to be taught anything. Um, and then um, we've got whatever that guy's name was, he says, I don't want to be part of anything that you're involved in. So he's not going to teach us. So I guess the only thing that we've got left is to go back to speak to Mr. Shu. I mean, we could go back to that martial place and fight the rest of the monks, but it's, it's, I'm not really interested in it, to be honest. Um, it's a waste of time and resources, I think, when we could be getting on with the game's main story. I really want to push on and see what's, what's in store for the rest of the game. I don't know how much is uh, left is left of this game, but I want to find out as soon as possible. And um, I don't really have a lot of money to be spending on food and replenishing my life. And We'll see what happens. We might get around to it during the DLC. We've got a bit more time because the DLC I believe is only like three or four hours long. So we might go to the hall during that time. One thing we haven't done is we haven't been in here to see what the hell this place is. Save Shenmue. Okay. What's this about then? This reminds me of Yokosuka. This is all looks good. The backers that put in money to help fund this game. Oh, this is cool. What's, what's this over here? Oh, it's a little, it's a miniature Yu Suzuki. <laughs> oh, that's nice. That's a nice little touch. What else is there? Got around here. More photos. What's in here? I haven't seen this. Oh, this is cool. I had no idea this was it. So what's down here then? Oh, we can fish here, can we? Oh, that is cool. Just found a new fishing spot. I didn't even know what was in this building. Now we found a building and a fishing spot as well. What's up here as well then? Oh, it's just somewhere to enjoy the view. This is nice though, man. Look at the detail, man. Alright. Maybe when we're doing the DLC or something, we might come back and just admire the view a little bit longer, but stuff to get on with. What's that there on the left? All these, all these little gumball machines. Uh. Caricature, Rios and Chenois. <laughs> and what are these then? Looks like machines that we can't play, I guess. So let's go and find Mr. Shu. Mr. Shu. Let's run past so I don't need to talk to her this time. Hi, Mr. Shu. Well, look who it is. Did you find Grandmaster Bay? Yeah, but he said I don't know enough Kung Fu, which is true. I don't know anything about it. Ah, I see. I figured someone around here might know about Kung Fu. Well, as you can probably tell, I'm your only hope. Yeah, I guess so. Hey, don't sound so disappointed. Come on, let's have a little sparring match. What? Oh! 
need to improve your kung fu, don't you? Sure. Well, you can get into a horse stance over there. Why don't you try it? Maybe I will. Yeah, I'll give it a shot. Okay, I guess I've got no choice to do this. Haven't done it in a while though, so let's begin. Time to broaden my search. I'll see if there's anywhere else martial artists gather. What's troubling you? Do you know where martial artists usually hang out around here? I've popped into the Muren Cafe once or twice. Maybe find them there? Lots of sparring going on. Um, the Muren Cafe, you say? Okay, so let's try the Muren Cafe again then, yeah? So let's head to the Moorin Cafe. Now we lost a lot of life, eh? Like right, nearly half a life already. And it's only quarter past eleven. I think we might have to chop some wood, you know. I'm spending a bit of money recently. Okay, let's go to the Moorin Cafe here. Let's ask this guy. We're always talking to her. Alright, and you got anything to say? Excuse me. Looking for a quick hit? Welcome to the newest hotspot in Yaowu, the Moorin Cafe. Do you know of anywhere I could practice Kung Fu? Kung Fu, huh? You've come to the right place. Huh? We offer Kung Fu practice sessions. The owner can fill you in on the details. Okay, thanks. Excuse me. I'm looking for a place I can practice Kung Fu. We offer martial arts practice sessions. So be sure to talk to the boss. Okay, thanks. Excuse me. Hello, and welcome. Welcome to the Mu Ren Cafe. Do you know anyone well-versed in Kung Fu? What for? 
I need to ask about styles with animalistic movements. Animal styles? Sorry, that's not my thing. I know more about non-tren and practice dummies. Would any of your customers know more? I'm really not sure. Sorry I couldn't be of more help. That's no problem. Want to at least practice some kung fu now that you're here? No. Practicing your horse stance is free. Horse stance, huh? Mr. Bay did say I'm not good enough at kung fu. Maybe I should give it a shot. Oh, Ken! This is all worth it in the end. I hope there's like some better reason than just to get stronger. Like it, it makes a difference for some reason other than just train for the sake of training. I mean, I know that they tried to make the combat a little different. Some people have not really liked it. Some people not sure about it. I'd say it's no different than The Witcher 3 to be honest but so I don't see what the complaint is but maybe it just doesn't translate well we'll see if what happens in Shenmue 4 I thought someone would know where I could practice martial arts guess I was wrong something I can help you with do you know where martial artists usually hang out around here probably over at Liu Ha Hall I've already been there actually Know any others? Hmm. This is just a rumor, but I've heard whispers of a back alley where street fights may or may not be held. They put on street fights there? Yeah. I hear that's where all the tough guys and gangsters hang out. Okay. There should be some martial artists there too. Thank you. Alright, we'll look into that, but maybe we should try some of the martial arts shops. Um, there's a guy who sells martial art books, there's a guy who sells martial art weapons. Um, so let's see what they know. There's one, is it here? It's... Actually, let's, let's try him, let's try him, let's try him. Excuse me. Hello and welcome. Every home needs a wooden dummy. Could I show you one? Actually, I was hoping you could tell me where martial artists meet up around here. A place where martial artists meet up? Maybe the nearby Muren Cafe. Already been there. It looks like the kind of place where martial artists would go. You should pay them a visit. Thank you very much. Well, you're not help. Just went there. Well, he's got some good stuff in it. He's got um, see the skill books there and um, snake potion. Let's go to the bookshop here. Uh, where is it? I can't remember where it is now. I think it's right at the front. Uh, yeah, that's the drinking place. That's the place to sell masks. Uh, we need some health. Right, so this guy's... Is it this guy? I think so, yeah. Excuse me. Hello and welcome. If it's martial arts you seek, look no further. Do you know where martial artists go to practice? Ah, uh, you might try the Rose Garden. What's that? That's where all the seasoned martial artists go to spar. You know the alley next to my shop, yeah? 
It's down there. No. Okay. Okay, at least Thanks. we know where it is. The alley next to your shop. Oh, this place. Didn't even notice it. Walked past it so many times. No running, okay, no wonder. I'm trying to run and it hasn't let me. Okay. Let's talk to him what, none of these people all right I guess I'd talk to the main man excuse me hey kid think you've got what it takes actually I need help with something it's best to let your fists do the talking that's what I always say now step right up I'm looking for a martial arts expert a martial arts expert what are you planning to do when you find them? Well, I recently saw someone use a strange style of martial arts. A strange style? Yes. The techniques were based on how animals move. I'm curious to know what that style is called. I see. Do you know anyone who could help me? I might. Really? Please tell me. If you really want to know, then get on up here! What? If you win, I'll tell you. Oh, you wanna bollocks. know, don't you? <laughs> He's just like Mr. Sure, isn't he? He just wants to fight me. Okay. I'll do it. Alright! It's yours for 800 tokens. You said 800 tokens, right? The entry fee, kid! The entry fee! Here. Alrighty, let's get started. And now for today's special bout. I don't know who he is, but give this drifter some applause. Huh? And his fearsome opponent? Feast your eyes on the ultimate weapon. Forged through endless practice at the port. The Mad Eagle, Riff. Tamblin! Thank you. Um... Huh? You want something? Please tell me about the martial arts expert. Martial arts expert? Yes. You said you knew something. Oh, that! Please tell me. Why don't you ask at the martial arts shop over there? Why? Did you think I would know about what martial arts styles look like? Right. I'm sure you can find out at the martial arts shop. That's what I know. I see. Thank you. Okay. So, we've got to go back there. I knew we had to go there, but he's making us go backwards to go forwards. So, the martial arts shop is just right outside. 
next door. No running allowed, so we're going to have to take the, our sweet time about it. But we're nearly there. This is the entrance here. And this is... No, where is he? This is the guy here. Excuse me. Hello and welcome. Um, Wrong one. Oh yeah? My bad. Excuse me. Ah, welcome to my shop. I'd like to ask something about martial arts. I love martial arts. Ask me anything. I saw a form with a strange stance. I was wondering if you could tell me its style. Interesting. Tell me more about it. The movements were really wide, and he could strike even from a distance. And the stance? The guy kept his head low and his arms raised behind him. <sighs> Do you know what this style is called? I need more to go on. Anything else you can tell me? There were animal movements mixed in. Animal movements? There are so many. It could be the White Crane, Snake Style, Tiger Fist. He used multiple animal movements. What kind of animals? If I were to guess... Those moves. That's Snake, I know that. He looked like a snake. Snake, you said? There is a unique form called Snake Style. Any other animals? Those moves. I'm pretty sure that's Leopard. He looked like a leopard. Leopard? <laughs> that's pretty rare. You gotta be quick and flexible to pull it off. Any other animals? Those moves. I've never heard of elephant style, I've heard of dragon. And then I can only think those movements mimic Chinese dragon dancing that you see in like when it's Chinese New Year. So I'm gonna go with dragon. He looked like a dragon. Dragon? Hmm. Sounds familiar. It sounds familiar, but I'm afraid that's all I can say about it. Any other animals? Those moves. I've never heard of panda style, I've heard of bear style, they're both I'm go with bear. He looked like a bear. Huh. First I've heard of that in the Xingyi Tren. Any idea what it might be? Not a clue. Sorry, bud. Oh, come on. Okay. Man. Thanks. I'll try asking elsewhere. The fact that I help you were. It's okay, so I've always got one of them wrong. So I'm guessing. The leopard style might be monkey. Um, just give me one moment, please. Sorry about that, I had to switch off the heat. It's roasting in here now. So, there's the other bookshop, isn't there, in the marketplace? So, I think leopard style might have actually been monkey. Oh, there's Shenmue. Just jump on her ass. Scare her, but can't do nothing. Oh, I can talk to her now. Excuse me. Hey, bro, you're here oh. now. No, no. Where is the martial arts shop? Buy some tokens. Then you can. You're here to. Uh, sorry. Life is money. Is right. Wrong person. Can't talk to her, really? Mm, okay. Um, yeah, the martial arts shop is. Where is it? I've completely forgotten now. Right. 
this place here. We went in here before. Pardon me. Huh? Sorry, I thought you were a fellow martial artist. Might I ask what your name is? You can call me Hazuki. All right then, Mr. Hazuki. Sorry for not introducing myself sooner. Call me Shang, owner of Kung Fu Tussle. Mr. Xiang, it is then. Mm, Kung Fu Please Tussle. You. After the, the movie, Kung, Kung Fu Hustle. Excuse me. What can I do for you? I'd like to ask something about martial arts. Well, this is a martial arts supply store. I can probably answer your question. I saw a form with a strange stance. I was wondering if you could tell me its style. Right. Can you tell me more about it? The movements were really wide, and he could strike, even from a distance. And the stance? The guy kept his head low, and his arms raised behind him. Fascinating. Do you know what the style is called? That's really not enough for me to guess. Could you describe it more? There were animal movements mixed in. Animal movements? Well, that helps. It could be the white crane, snake style, tiger fist. He used multiple animal movements. What kind of animals? If I were to guess... Oh, there we go again. Those moves. That's definitely snake. He looked like a snake. I've heard there's a martial arts style that took its inspiration from a snake. What other animal forms were there? Those moves. Okay, that's got to be monkey. He looked like a monkey. There's a form in Xing Yi Chuan called monkey form that mimics monkeys. What other animal forms were there? Those moves. Okay, that's got to be dragon. He looked like a dragon. There's a form in Xing Yi Chuan called the dragon form. Oh, I think we've done it. What other animal forms were there? Oh, damn, I forgot those one moves. Move. Bear. There's a bear form in Xing Yi Chuan. A big body that utilizes multiple animal forms. That style is probably... Xing Yi Liu Ha Chuan. That's my guess. Xing Yi Liu Ha Chuan. It has the same roots as Xing Yi Chuan as an internal martial art, but it's slightly different. For instance, they base their forms on the ten great spirit animals. Ten? You probably saw some of those animal forms. Can you tell me more about the style? Xing Yi Liu Ha Chuan has been called one of the most powerful and fighting oriented styles. Of course, how it is. do I beat it? <laughs> they have monstrous strikes from a distance, but it's not without its weaknesses. Close up the distance and use a short range and powerful it's technique. Like boxing. Short guy versus a short, short guy. range and powerful technique? There's a signature Baji Chuan technique that fits the bill. What move is that? If only I had an arcane book. A what? A Baji Chuan arcane book? Yeah, but I'm afraid we don't have any here. Alright, so what, got to go to the bookstore again? Bookstore. one isn't it so that guy didn't have it so we've got to try the first guy who we spoke to 
Let's see if he's got anything. So this guy up ahead here is the guy that we need to speak to. This guy, yeah. Excuse me. Hello and welcome. If it's martial arts you seek, look no further. Do you have any Baji Tren arcane books? Oh boy. Now there's a question. I'm afraid I don't. Sorry, bud. Okay. Thanks. Okay, so there's there's somebody next to equipment. The guy who had ordered these different skill books. Um, so maybe we can ask him. I don't know. Off, I'm tr tr trying to think really hard at the moment. If to, who else there might be? Well, I can't at the moment. Um, let's speak to this guy first. It is oh shit. Just up here somewhere. Is it the last shop? Oh, oh, oh my bad. Up the stairs. This guy. Excuse me. Hello and welcome. Every home needs a wooden dummy. Could I show you one? Do you have any Baji Tren arcane books? Arcane books, eh? That's quite advanced. I don't have any here. Okay. Thanks anyway. Ah, uh, you know what? I think I know where we've got to go and look. I'm not 100% sure, but it's probably somewhere right at the back of the level. Some place that, if I'm remembering right, when we went to go um, duck hunt hunting, or well, not hunting, but goose chasing, and I didn't go into it. I didn't really see what it was. It looked old. If it's not a bookshop, then it looked like it might be a library. Um, I can't remember how to get there. Maybe it's on the side here somewhere. Oh, look, this is all open now. Yeah, this is the area, so look, you can get to that place from the Muren Cafe. That's the little bridge there that takes you to the cafe. Now, yeah, this building on the right side. What does it say? Can't see, man. Heaven, Heaven's Fist, okay, it sounds like a martial arts shop. Let's see what we've got in here. Bingo, I think we found what we need to find. Excuse me. Looking for something? Do you have any Baji Tren arcane books? Baji Tren, you say? I may have one. Are you willing to sell it? I suppose I could. Let's see here. But it's old and dusty. The reverse body check. Reverse body check? <gasps> uh. <laughs> <laughs> this. How much is it? Have we? Oh, luckily we got enough money. I'll take it. Mmm, a wise purchase. Now, here's the reverse body check skill book.
radio. Shenhua, look. I got the Baji Tren Arcane Book. This is the key to beating the Red Snake's boss. That's great. Just don't push yourself too hard. I can't. Not yet, anyway. I just bought it. Now comes the hard part. Making it mine. I suggest, Ryo, that you should rest up today. Hmm? Maybe you're right. This is one of the trend. Reverse body check, huh? H hey, the last page is missing. Oh, are you the... serious? What are Paid we five do? grand for a missing page. Hmm. Oh well, my own fault. Why be Master Bay will know what was on the last page. I'll try asking him. This is the reverse body check. A signature move of Baji Tren, one of the most powerful moves in Chinese martial arts. But the last page is missing. I believe you can guess what was on it. Please, Grandmaster. When we sparred, you showed me a few Baji Tren moves. Who taught them to you? My father. And Grandmaster Tao Li Shao. Tao Li Shao. I'm familiar with the name. Seems you have a knack for Baji Tren. Please show me. I could teach you more, but if you lack Kung Fu, its power will be halved. I understand. Do you? Honestly, I don't think your Kung Fu is strong enough. Uh, Grandmaster, I... The White Dragon of Ushun Hall. The trainee in front of the hotel. He's quite strong. Oh, are you serious? Try to beat him. The White Dragon of Ushun Hall. If you beat him, I'll acknowledge your Kung Fu. Okay, well, I wasn't expecting that. Not at this point in the game. Okay, so we have to go to Marshall Hall or whatever it's called. Straight ahead. Uh, running low on resources, I didn't really want to fight any of the people from the hall there. So it looks like we've got no choice. Excuse me. Have you come to train? You can practice your Kung Fu on a wooden dummy, or polish your techniques by sparring. You can also test your skills in a real match. What will you do? You want to have a match? This time I'll have you face White Wolf. All right, this guy. Easy. Well, well. You even beat White Wolf. 
That moves you up to fourth dawn. I have to admit, you have some impressive moves. Gold Wolf will be your opponent this time. Angry. Actually beat Gold Wolf. That makes you fifth to one. A true testament to your efforts. But there are even stronger opponents that await you. Red Dragon will be your opponent. You currently fight with moderate skill. Fought. You beat Red Dragon. That makes you sixth dawn. Set your sights even higher and keep climbing. Black Dragon should be the perfect opponent. Okay. So it looks like there's probably going to be ten of them. Magnificent fight! You beat Black Dragon, so you have been promoted in rank. Keep it up, warrior. Dragon. He's a rather strong opponent. Dragon, you're something else. I'm happy to promote you to the next rank. Let's pair you with a valiant opponent, the one and only White Dragon. I wonder how you'll fare. You're not simple, 
Bested white dragon. That's something I thought I'd never see. Congratulations on another promotion. Niawu rarely sees a warrior like you. Great. Now Master Bay will teach me the technique. I should go see him. Grandmaster. Mm -hmm. I defeated White Dragon at Wushan Hall. So please. Teach me the Baji Chen signature move. Hmm. All right then. It's my book as well. I paid for it. You must know the body check before learning this move. I already Can do. you do it? The body check is a move where you dodge your opponent's attack and circle around them. Try it. On me. Again? Mm, no. You may well learn the technique, but if you lack the proper skill, it will not be effective. I've got a trophy called so G. So you would better keep training. Yes, of course. Thank you. Did you figure out what the Baji Trend signature move is? Yeah, Grandmaster Bay taught it to me. Sweet. This time that bear guy's going down. Hey, are you slacking off again? Let's get to that hideout. Right. Hey, get over here. What is it? First the red snakes, now this little Betty. What ex Huh? You're asking me? <laughs> we mean you no harm, ma'am. You can trust us. Where did the people here go? I have no idea who you mean. The red snakes that were holed up here. And that guy that looks like a gorilla. Not exactly hard to miss. I had them leave. Huh? This land belongs to me, so I had them leave. Do you know where they went? They said they were headed to the old castle. The old castle? The one across the water. They even took a young lady. A young mm. lady? Yo, let's go. Nothing left to do here. She's been watching us, I can tell. The moment we got off the boat. And we found her in the marketplace as well, remember? for you. If you want to save your little girlfriend, bring the mirror to the old castle. Where's this from? A woman suddenly appeared and left here with your friend. The red snakes got your friend. What, Leo? Come with me. How would she know anyway? She's just some random stranger. Hmm. 
that woman. Mm -hmm. Is this girlfriend that girl that was with you? I'm going to help her. Now hold it. There's nothing we can do today. Damn. Just sleep on it, okay? Let's meet at the port tomorrow to hatch a plan. Okay, I guess we've got a sleep on this for tonight. Apples. Yeah. Looks right. good. Guess I'll take it. So we are done here at the moment. So let's see what happens as we continue. <laughs>